Hey friends, I just want to jump on here and say thank you so much for being part of my online community and being part of my digital newsletter. During times like these, we can really start to see how valuable community is. And with all the recent events and the uncertainty and the fear that is circulating through the collective right now, um, I really want to be of service to help guide because I'm feeling it. Um, I sat in meditation this morning and I set my timer. After just a few deep breaths, I just started crying and a lot of stress and fear and worry, uncertainty, all this came up to the surface. But from practice, I know that that's the process. I know that I've created this safe container in my practice to allow all those things to come up and to be aware of them. And what meditation teaches you to do is to be sensitive and aware and allow all that to come up so it doesn't live within your nervous system, doesn't live in your body and come out as blind reactions. It comes up so you can sit with it and then not react to it. And so you become equanimous. And I found myself labeling tears, fear, worry, anxiety, and even like an inner child, like whimpering within me, um, you know, being very scared. And I just sat with it. And after about a couple rounds of breath, it passed. And I actually felt much stronger. And then I just sat with that. So at the end of my practice, I always do some journaling, you know, I use my daily tracker and this is also something I use with my clients and encourage them to um, really track their journey of transformation. Um, I did some free writing and inquiry and I was just asking, how can I be of service right now with everything that we have going on? Like how can I use my experience 15 years in the wellness industry as a professional through many different facets and and ways of working in wellness and fitness, how can I use the tools that I've gained to help others? Because I know that we all have our own unique gifts and talents and paths, and not everybody has had the experiences of learning um, tools to calm the mind and work the body in a way that is balanced and promoting longevity or um, experience with making healthy recipes and knowing what to do in that structure. So I was thinking, I was like, well, this is something that I love to do. It's very natural for me to do. How can I use it during this time to guide people to um, find that resiliency within themselves? Because you know, the ego loves control. It wants to like, it, it does not like this uncertainty that we're experiencing right now. And the more I meditate, um, and go through this life journey, I find how little we actually control. And we've never really been in control of anything. So these times are very shattering for the ego and very humbling, and there can be a lot of emotions that come up around that. Um, so, so while it feels like there's so much that is out of our control, it's like, well, what can we do? Um, what we can do is choose our thoughts and choose love over fear. And we can choose how we react to the situation. We can choose how we react and interact with others from a distance right now, <laughs> um, virtually. And we can choose the food that we put into our bodies. We can choose whether we work out at home and we sweat and we boost our endorphins, we take care of our bodies inside and out. We can choose if we meditate and calm our minds and allow those emotions to come up and surface so they can be washed away. These are choices that we have every single day. And I think during times like these, when we're in this pause, this global pause and place of stillness, we can really start to practice these things and we can find how important and valuable they are. So I just want to jump on here and let you know that I'm offering my services online. Um, I'm also still seeing clients in San Diego outdoors, but we're keeping distance, <laughs> um, being socially responsible. Um, 
I'm offering my customized coaching program that includes fitness, mobility, nutrition, lifestyle coaching, rituals to help you with focusing the mind, being productive, enhancing creativity, building a meditation practice, and just really reaching the next level of your life. This can be a this time can be a springboard for your transformation if you use your time well. Um, I'm also offering online workouts. So through um, online conferencing, we can work together on mobility training and elemental conditioning classes. Take a look at that page, kellygonzalez.com forward slash elemental conditioning, and you can find a whole list of classes that I have and we can go through those together. So everything from breath work and um, a split strength training routine at home that you can do, um, exercise programs for building muscle, burning fat, um, more mobility, all of those facets of a well-balanced fitness program, all those elements are in there. So if you're in need of any of those services, please contact me. My website is kellygonzalez.com. Email is kelly at kellygonzalez.com. Send me a message and let's use this time to really raise the vibration of the collective and enhance your health, your mind, and elevate your spirit. Thank you so much. I'm Kelly Gonzalez, and I'll talk to you soon. Be well.